Brinda Ali Spalzi, il auguro una lunga vita di amore. Which translates to, I toast to the newlyweds and I wish them a long life of love. Even the future beyond the beyond. Now it's time to have got my favourite person. He's so handsome, he's so funny. And it's a real shame he couldn't be here today. Please raise your glasses to Tina, everybody. This is an absolute honour for me to be able to say this, but for the first time as husband and wife, can we please give it up, wave your napkins in the air, and make as much noise as you can for the new Mr. and Mrs. Bakeri. She underrates. Today is a day you will always remember the greatest in anyone's life. You'll start off the day just two people in love and end it as husband and wife. It's a brand new beginning, the start of a journey with moments to cherish and treasure. And although there'll be times when you both disagree, these will surely be outweighed by pleasure. You'll have heard many words of advice in the past when the secrets of marriage were spoken, but you know that the answers lie hidden inside where the bond of true love lies unbroken. So live happy forever as lovers and friends. It's the dawn of a new life for you. As you stand there together with love in your eyes, the way when you whisper, I do. Go, you don't need these two. Shut you off, no. My guilt is really your reason. Nikki, I promise. Nikki, I promise. That I will respect you as an individual. That I will respect you as an individual. Support you through difficult times. Support you through difficult times. Rejoice with you through happy times. Rejoice with you through happy times. Be loyal to you always. Be loyal to you always. And above all. And above all. Love you as my partner and friend. Love you as my partner and friend. Michael, I also promise. Michael, I also promise. That I will respect you as an individual. That I will respect you as an individual. Support you through difficult times. Support you through difficult times. Rejoice with you through happy times. Rejoice with you through happy times. Be loyal to you always. Be loyal to you always. And above all. And above all. Love you as my partner and friend. Love you as my partner and friend. Nikki, I give you this ring. As a sign of our love and marriage. As a sign of our love and marriage. And as an outward sign. And as an outward sign. Of the commitment we have made to each other today. Of the commitment that we have made to each other today. Michael, I give you this ring. Michael, I give you this ring. As a sign of our love and marriage. As a sign of our love and marriage. And as an outward sign. And as an outward sign. Of the commitment we have made to each other today. Of the commitment we have made to each other today. Little darling, why did you pour, pour out? Can't you see your reflection is cold? You don't need these two. Please.
privilege and pleasure to announce you are now legally married, husband and wife. Would you like to have a Ken? excited for this it's the only five minutes of the wedding that Nikki hasn't planned so uh, so strap yourselves in <laughs> I'm joking she maybe rehearsed this in front of Parangino yesterday so no problem I often say that the best day of my life was when I first told Nikki I loved her it was our first day is officially being boyfriend and girlfriend we were getting ready for a night out in Leicester and we ended up having a slight disagreement we agreed to not let it ruin our first night as an official couple. I'm sure you all know, Nikki had other ideas. As the night progressed and we were at a bar getting a drink, our disagreement continued. This caught the barman's attention, who said to Nikki, is this guy bothering you? She looked at me and then turned to the barman and said, yeah. 10 seconds later, I was being dragged out the club by a bouncer with Nikki following with a smack on her face. In mind side, pretty funny. As we started walking home together, we continued our disagreement. I was hopeful to reconcile, <laughs> but my efforts seemingly failed. Nikki then turned to me and said, why do you even care? And I said, because I fucking love you, all right? <laughs> and just like that, the disagreement didn't mean anything and we walked home hand in hand. But she still made me sleep on the floor that night. <laughs> so that was what I used to tell people was the best day of my life. But now I can tell them that today has been the best day of our life. Bucker! <laughs> my husband! <laughs> Thank you for asking me to be your girlfriend nine years ago and your wife around 18 months ago. Thank you for always making me laugh, always making me a cup of tea, and always saying sorry first. <laughs> I'm excited for this next chapter of our life as husband and wife. I'm not sure where it will take us, but I do know that we'll be laughing along the way. I do have to say, Mike, how lucky you really are. You get to leave today with a wife who's caring, funny, and we can all agree looks absolutely stunning. I mean, you're lucky too, uh, Nikki. You get to leave today with an amazing dress and some beautiful flowers. Look really good. Mike left uni with a girl that he's now truly blessed to call his wife. <laughs> from there, they've gone from strength to strength, buying their first house together, raising little Gino. Gino! <laughs> and generally living life to the fullest. I think we can all agree that Mike and Nikki are perfectly matched uh, with each other and will have many happy years together. There is some lemon channel on the tables, so we could raise a glass for the newlyweds. Stand up, please, all be standing for the new Mr. and Mrs. Bacari. Honestly, you two are two 
actually were the best friends that I could ever ask for. When I think back on all the things that we've done, honestly, some of the very best moments of my entire life have been with you two. Nikki, you make me laugh without even trying. I think the sign of a good friendship is when you can take the piss out of each other, and that's all Nikki does to me, so. <laughs> and Bucker, you are one of the kindest, most genuine people I've ever met in my entire life. I know that I've found a friend for life in you, mate. I love you more than you'll ever know. Can I please raise one more glass to the new Mr. and Mrs. Bakeri? Yeah.